Hello everyone. Today I want to give you a quick introduction on how to use Mod Commander. You will find a link to Mod Commander in the PV4 PDF file. Once you download it, extract all the files somewhere on your computer and you can copy and paste a shortcut to this little icon file here, which is the application itself, somewhere on your desktop. After you download all of the PV4 mods that you want, all the mod packs you want, just put them all into a folder. Here we have one, it's named PV4 Files. Now when you use Mod Commander, just double click and run the program and you will see first thing it asks you is which program you want to use, LS13 or LS11. Select 13, click Next and it will open up a window. I already have one folder that is already linked, which you will probably have your default folder shortcut there, but what we're going to do is we're going to click this little button right here. We are going to my desktop and looking for the PV4 files folder and click OK and then click Save. And that's really all you have to do. It will now use that folder that I have the PV4 files in to run launch the game. You can close the program down and say you want to now switch back to the previous folder that you were using. It's the same process, but all the links to the folders that you had in here will stay. So it's simply going and clicking approved and click save again and now I'm back on my original folder. And that's pretty much how simple Mod Commander is to switch between folders and keep your files separate for your maps and it really does work a lot better. Thank you and I hope you find this tutorial helpful.